right. Campos and I are here today to talk about a new product we added to the Go Hunt gear shop. This is the Zolio Satellite Communicator. Both of us have actually used this on hunts this fall. Yep. So I'm just going to give you a little rundown why you uh, might want to pick one of these up. The price is a great price point, $199 for the Zolio. Uh, very easy to use. Uh, it comes with a free app, mobile app. You can uh, text just like you would text a friend. Um, when I was using this in the field, it was super fast. I was very impressed with the communication back and forth, uh, weather updates back and forth, super easy. Um, if you don't want to connect to the your actual mobile app, you can set a preset and just hit the little check mark, uh, kind of mail looking box on the front, and let people know that you're safe, uh, let them know your location. Uh, within the app, you can choose to send your location or not. Um, and you got the SOS in case you fall down, break a leg, or you need help, uh, you'll have that option there. I have dropped it the night that Brady came by my house to uh, pick it up, I handed it to him, and I missed, and I hit the ground. So uh, it's very durable. It's durable, uh, it's water resistant, and uh, so far, I really like it. The price point's good. One thing I really liked about it too was battery life. It yeah. has a, you know, it's a bigger unit, so it has a lot longer battery life. And it's just super rugged. There's not like a screen in front of it that could get scratched. It comes with carabiner. Mm -hmm. One thing I like about carabiner too, like I did with previous, you know, satellite communicators, is just strapping that right to a vinyl harness so it's always like on your body. You don't want to shove it in your backpack, then you won't ever have access to use it. In case you fall, get in a weird situation, you can actually be able to punch that SOS so a SOS button so you want to keep it on your body. You can make it so it makes sound when uh, when you send a message you receive it, or you can turn it off. Mm -hmm. Brady was able to figure that out. I was not. You gotta turn that off. It makes it. For hunting situations, yeah, you might be glassing, maybe far away from mouth, but it does make a loud noise when you send and receive messages, so definitely dive into settings and yeah. uh, turn that off. Okay, another really cool feature of this too, it's gonna you know, decipher what option you might wanna go with. Zolio will actually allow you to send messages uh, a thousand characters. On my app right now, I was texting my dad earlier, and boom, on the bottom it says 1,047 characters. And as I type, it goes down. So you actually can see how many you know characters you have left in the message. So you can type out, a giant long letter yeah in a sense email details to of the hunt whatever. detail yeah exactly what you want to send them so that's a pretty cool feature yeah it's kind of a pain when you have when you're limited and you don't want to go over to another uh, send another message especially if you're limited on how many messages you can send in a month so another good feature so you don't have one now I definitely like you said recommend it but mainly for me it's like the battery life is so huge and it's just so much faster to communicate back and forth which is really yeah. what I think is a great feature because you don't sit there and wait, is it sending? It's like boom, almost like instantaneous. Yep. You can actually have like a real conversation on the Zolio. Yep. The app, the Zolio app is super easy to use. You text on uh, whatever you need to text. Um, you can send a location or choose not to send your location. Um, you can uh, check the weather and see here. This uh, last check. To, um, so I just updated. By the time I just swiped up, um, it's updated. You're showing me what's going on for the next uh, one, two, three, four days there, and go hourly. If you're looking at you know what's going on in your unit where you're at, um, if you, you it will show you messaging in progress. If you need to speed up, you can uh, tell it to check again because normally it'll be set to check every five or ten minutes. Um, you can uh, push it to check faster. Um, what are the features? It has the SOS option in there. Um, Battery life, like I said, yeah, just they pretty, say, pretty e easy. Everything you need in the app to control it. Yep. And I found the weather is a feature I've always used on these satellite communicators. It's like, weather's always changing out there. And so it's like nice to be able to constantly update the weather to know what kind of conditions you're gonna be getting into the next couple of days. Yep. You need yep. to hunker down, you need to tighten down the tent a little bit. Yep. You'll be able to figure that out right here in the app. You can see what time the sun's setting, what time it's rising, so you can plan that as well. A lot of times you're going to a different state, you're like, the your time zone's different, so you got to be able to plan that. So, um, super handy, super helpful. So here's a little comparison of the size of the Garmin InReach Mini compared to the Zolio. So not that much of a difference when you add up this big tall, you know, antenna on the top. You know, it's a little wider, but again, you have a lot more battery life here. You know, the screen to look at. You use everything on your phone. Get a lot of questions about which model to choose, Zolio or the Garmin, which situation, you know, causes which one. So if you never bought either of these, basically what's going to come down to: Are you weight conscious, or would you rather have a little bigger unit, a little more battery life, and maybe not have a screen versus a screen on the Garmin? So basically, it's a personal preference. 
and figuring out what your use case is. Ounce counter compared to guys that want some solid features, cheaper price point, all around. You know, yep. Both are solid units, but at least you have options now. There's no tracking on the Zolio with the Garmin. You do have tracking if you wanted to track your, your, uh, your path or whatever. Um, so that's one feature you don't get with the Zolio, mm -hmm. but also create options. So there you have it, Zolio Satellite Communicator. If you have any questions, be sure to drop them down in the comments below. Campo and I will definitely reach out and answer those for you. And uh, of course, like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'll keep more of these coming. If you have any questions, again, drop them down below. Zolio. Zolio.